Hello, thank you for tuning in. This is Myra with Happy So Happy Life. So I wanted to put this out there because there's pretty intense scenarios that are out in the open. Feels like who wants the lottery ticket and everybody running to get it, but not knowing that it will take you down the rabbit hole. We are seeing the polarity that it, the polarity that is taking place in the world it very much feels like the red pill or the blue pill. But either way, the world will continue to move forward. The archetypes that are showing up is victimism and betrayal, which is all part of childhood trauma that we endured. Energies that come in are here to assist in removing a layer of the veil, to be one step closer to your true self. Take time to understand the root of the archetype that has been activated, whether you are the manipulator or you are being manipulated. It all leads to one thing, love. A concept that we all can understand when one truly wants to heal disruptive behavior. I also did an interpretation for the tarot and this is what it gave me. Darkness looks like it's closing in, but understand that you hold the light and light will be shed in this situation. You will be getting clarity, knowledge that will help you get through the darkness. A lot of emotions are flowing around. Maintain your ground by being balanced. You are enough and you are able to change the course with taking action. Every day is a new day to start fresh. The truth about God consciousness is that we aim too low in how we live our lives. The suffering is over. No more ple pleading for scraps. Honor thyself. Know better. Aim higher as we are here to live fruitful life. As always, love and light. One of the other things that you can definitely do for yourself at this time is be present for yourself. Detach from the person or situation and be direct. Do not dress it up when it comes to communication. An affirmation is, I am worthy of being heard. I am the voice. All right. Until next time, my beautiful friends. Namaste.